everything's clear, I'm not bad at making videos. I'm literally really good. I think. This is my first video, so I'm kind of nervous. But I don't act nervous when I'm nervous. Or can you tell? So just don't comment, please. Because this is my first video. And yeah. So... I'm with the video. Here comes the doll, not fat or white. Not the box is white. Anyway, this is the box. On the side, it looks like some sort of book detailing. It's got a page detailing up here. It's got a shoe. Watch on Netflix ever after high. Ashlinella, daughter of Cinderella. This thing here, the Ashlinella thing. This name tag thing here looks like a sticker stuck over something else but let's not dwell on that here it has some sort of mirror or picture frame of ashlyn i don't know it says ever after high daughter of cinderella ashlyn Ella. he said it says ever after high cheers you on death no cheers you on ever after then it says a bunch of stuff here eh. Eh. starring dash and included it says stuff down the bottom, it's like advertising themselves. It's got Bride Beauty, Apple, Apple White, and Ashlyn L. She's so pretty. So yeah, this is this is the box. Read it if you want, but I don't want to. Because I make mistakes when I read, when I'm nervous. So yeah. So she's pretty. She's so pretty. I'm stuck in box, help me! came to cut it open. These are big scissors. I'm bad with scissors. I'm probably gonna cut myself. Yeah, yeah. I'm obsessed with these scissors. Eh. Eh. That's my strawberry pillow. That'll be featured in all my videos. How do I open this thing? No, it's recording. Here's a tip. If you want to keep the back of your box, or the whole box, which is probably really hard, then, so you don't have to cut it, try and like, See this thing here? Try and pull it out without ripping anything. Then you'll get the doll out. In my case, Ashlyn. Okay, don't ask for many tips from me because I'm not good at it. Especially with unboxing dolls because usually I just rip everything. And now I just chuck everything away except the doll and all the accessories and stuff. Here's the first one. I had to cut it a little bit just to free it. Don't worry, cutting this thing doesn't damage the box. So yeah. Whenever I think to myself, I'm going to keep this box. I never do. Because of this. This thing. It has... you got to like cut the pla plastic bit. Okay, yeah. Here's the doll. Half unboxed. I can feel her hair. It is soft. This is... <gasps> it's not gelled. Yay! Is it just me or is it really hot in here? Ugh. I'm going to go turn the fan on. Just so you know, the stand thing comes in a bag. You're gonna need scissors to cut this open. So don't take them back to the kitchen, thinking, I don't need these anymore. Just to help. Okay, I am so sorry. I'm so sorry if the lighting might be different because I dropped, no, the iPad fell over and it showed my face. So then I had to spend like half an hour watching tutorials to find one that told me how to delete scenes so you don't get to see my face. Yay. That's good for me. I don't know about you. Let's continue. Ashlyn, get over here. What? Oh, hey. Ah, sorry, it dropped. I need something. <laughs> this is Ashlyn. Okay. So Ashlyn has a little bun in her hair. Well, starting with her hair. It's like this golden color. It sort of shines when the light reflects on it. It's really pretty. It's like sort of golden syrupy color. She's got this little headpiece. I mean, I have no idea what it's supposed to be. Just see if that works. Nope, it doesn't. Um, it looks like some sort of birds. Maybe. She's got a plait on her head. But the, in the ending ends in a little spike thing here. 
but I think that's supposed to be there. Mm -hmm. The thing about this is she's missing her shoe earrings. I cut this bit off the box. She's missing her shoe earrings, her classic shoe earrings. How can they do that? Anyway, she's got green eyes, pink eyeshadow, pink lipstick. Um, her necklace, if it would, if the camera would focus, looks like I don't know beads with a rose and a a rose inside a birdcage. Hmm. Well, Mattel has no end to their interesting ideas. Don't tell them. I said that. Hmm. So yeah, that. What? What? Oh. Oh. Okay. So she's got weird pink puffy sleeves, and then the sleeves go down in more puffs, but they're sort of blue, clearish fabric. I don't know. It's rough, but this bit here is smooth. Yeah. Same on the other arm. Um, she's got like some sort of blouse thing here, except it's all connected. Every single layer is connected. This is just one huge dress. Um, it's like blue with a v-neck thing, but it's not v-neck, it's got a bit inside there. That's this weird and nice gold trim. This looks, some, looks like some sort of cherry blossom pattern. Um, she's got this, you can see my finger, but, hmm. and it's the same material as on her. Well no, it's different, it's different. It's similar to her arm. She's got the cherry blossom pattern thingy again, like up here. Um, she's got these lovely blue shoes, um, as featured in the videos. The heels may come a bit bent from being in the package, but do not worry. She'll stand up if she has a stand. It, it, look, it looks like vines sort of curling around her legs. I like that effect. I like that. And these look like a glass slipper. I don't have it. No! I don't have it! These look like little glass slippers. Like Cinderella's glass slippers, except higher. Bigger heels. And it's got the vines as well. So that is the doll. Wait. Wait a minute. I forget this! Eh, I can move this thing. That looks weird, I know, but don't worry. It looks like sort of crown on her arm, I think. Eh. Okay, that's not working. Let's put my Smiggle pencil case in front of it. Don't worry, Smiggle, I'm advertising you. Upside down. Hmm. Upside down advertisement. Looks like a crown bracelet. Then her little ring. Has this cute little bird on it. It's so cute. I would wear that, except it's really big. <laughs> um, if I can find a handbag, oh, here it is. This is a handbag. Um, this is like sort of beads, but they don't move. Um, it's like four clock faces. I didn't. I don't understand the clock. Oh. Huh. That's like when the clock strikes midnight from a story. That's why it's clocks. The thing, I, the only thing I don't like about this is it's, is it's a bit bulky, but I don't really mind that. And that only one side is coloured. I bet they're all coloured. The clock, the clock tells the time. Oh, I don't know. I think it's like nine o'clock. Something. It's the same on all of them, I think. Yeah. I cut this off the box. I cut this off the box. Don't worry about the white patches. Um, this is a stand. I haven't assembled it yet. Wait one minute. This is her stand. It is the same as Bunny Blanc's and um Rosabella Beauties. I only know that because I have those two dolls. Let's see her on her stand. Let's see her with her handbag. So this is the Ashlyn Isle doll. Oh, I forgot to mention. Her shirt's a bit sparkly. That's nice. 
That's nice, isn't that? Isn't it, Ashley? Mm-hmm. It's sparkly. I know that. I just said that. Duh. <laughs> so that has been my first video. I hope you enjoy it. Um, comment, like, subscribe if, if this ever goes on YouTube. And yeah. Yeah. Subscribe. Comment. So yeah, hope the video hasn't been too weird, and yeah, have a happy holiday, if you've been watching, watching this on the holiday. Please watch this video, okay, comment, like, subscribe, um, so yeah, that was my Ashley Miller dorm review. Hope you have a nice holiday, bye! My turn for screen time!